You don't have to believe me because I am a Pleiadian spirit. You just have to ask your heart if my information is true. I am Sincera. I am one of the returning Pleiadian ancestors who speak to you from the fifth dimension above your third dimension of matter. Since my existence is non-physical and immaterial, you can call me a spirit, a Pleiadian spirit. My name is in fact Sincere Ra. Ra means a ray of sunlight. Ra is also the name given to a Pleiadian collective now operating on Earth. Ra is our tribal name, and sincere means what it means in English. I use this composite name to communicate with my family on Earth. The best way to resonate with me is to be sincere yourself. I am a ray of the Pleiadian family of light, here to reveal answers hidden in plain sight. In our last episode, I reviewed one of our Neolithic campuses on Earth, Caromor in Ireland. In this episode, I continue my revelations about Ireland as an exemplary Pleiadian island. We, the Pleiadian Relief Mission that has landed on Earth over 11,000 years ago, initiated the worldwide Neolithic Revolution not all at once, but step by step, region by region, century by century. Among the many centers of civilization that we had set up around the globe was the island today called Ireland. We came to Ireland around 5000 BC. We first landed in the area today called the Hill of Tara. Here, we made the first contact with tribes of people living in the surrounding area who were our relatives, our family on Earth. We came to Ireland to help our family in this part of the world. The catastrophe that happened around 10,000 BC diminished the food source for humans around the globe, and Ireland was no exception. Although by the time we arrived on her shore, the worst situation was long over, our family on this island were struggling to survive, and starvation was common. We came to bring food for our family, to bring new types of food that could forever change the dark situation they were in. We came with the gift of agriculture. Our gift of agriculture had been fully developed since our first landing in the Middle East around 9000 BC. We were able to bring to Ireland a full package of stock species. Wheat, barley, sheep, goats, cows, hens, and pigs. You could say the Neolithic Revolution had a quick and thorough start in Ireland, the starting point of agriculture and the starting point of civilization was here at the hill of Tara. Seven thousand years ago, the hill of Tara was a forest with abundant springs. We landed on a meadow in a large glade. The landing of our craft imprinted on the earth a set of concentric circles. The form provided a vibrational anchor for our craft, our interdimensional ship of light. The form was maintained for a long period to accommodate our visitations, 
in the centuries that followed. This was our landing pad. You could call it a keyhole. Our ship of light was the key. It took several Earth's human generations for a gift of agriculture to spread out in Ireland. By 4,500 BC, a basic level of farming practice had been established throughout the island. We invited a number of tribes to the top of the hill to our first landing site for a special event to co-create a monument. We worked together, we the tall ethereal Pleiadian humans, and they the small earth humans. We dug the soil together with stone shovels and spades. With joint effort, we imprinted on the land a pair of circular enclosures. After 6,500 years of remodeling and erosion, our monument lost its sharp edge and precise form. Yet you can still see that one side is convex and one side concave. Now fold the two sides into one, a symbol for reunion, two sides of a galactic human family are reunited as one. As time went on, we co-created more circles here on the low, broad hill. This first pair was to remain an everlasting sign of love. The sign delivers a simple but profound message. We are here. The hill of Tara became the heart center of Ireland. Down through history, it has been revered as the most sacred place, as the royal seat of the Celtic High Kings. It became the starting point of Christianity and the legendary Wedding Hill. We chose the prehistoric Tara circles to represent a global event, the event of our return in the 21st century. We ancient Pleiadian civilizers have returned to review not only our sites but also our civilizations of light. We are back to reunite with you, our beloved family. And family means you recognize us in your heart.
The details of our landing at Tara had been given in book form. If you want to wait for Pleiadian revelations in a video form, well, we'll meet again soon in our next episode. <laughs>